this is our new air float boring bar um, the reason it's uh, called an air float boring bar is because it says here air float and if we press that button it floats on air what this does is it lets us um, guide the the boring bar and the catch paws down into the cylinders on air and then at that point we tighten the catch paws this lets them expand in the bars expand in the cylinder bar the one it's boring and centralizes it and then we press the clamp button here which activates the uh, industrial magnets then we back off the catch paws raise the bar again manually we can do this uh, under power but we like to do it manually place in the preset cutting tip the carbide tip lock it in the place this is always done by a simple allen key approach the cylinder bar a bit closer and then we put everything into gear and then it starts to cut that's removing all the old dead cylinder and tracking a nice new a nice new bar down the bar so to speak down the cylinder this one here has already been done and it's the size and we're doing this one now it progresses at a set rate which is all controlled by the gears there's a couple of different speeds on this bar there's high and low to begin with when we're rough cutting we're going on the high speed this removes the amount of metal that we need and then we go to the slow speed for the finishing cut which is the last accurate size before honing of the new piston this is a new piston that's going inside this engine it's really good quality it's got the steel band in here where the uh, top compression ring goes and it's got the teflon coating on the sides quality that's what we say about these this is a Mitsubishi new L200 um, it's the DID engine out of the animal or the warrior and it's just getting a rebar because it's done the usual which has melted the piston and in turn wrecked the bars so we're putting the fresh steel over size then after this machine's done its job we'll do a hone to leave a cross at then we fit the new pistons in We'll just leave this machine to do its job. I'll speak to you soon.